Hey guys and welcome back. So today I'm super excited because fall and the Halloween season is upon us and I have partnered with Party City to share with you an unboxing of all of the awesome spooky Halloween items that I got for less than $100. And I'm gonna be using all of these items to create a spectacular display in our entryway. So I'm just gonna go ahead and share everything with you that I purchased and then stay tuned for the end of the video because I will be sharing with you how everything looks set up in our entryway. And if you love Halloween and parties as much as I do, I highly recommend checking out Party City. They have an amazing selection of Halloween decor. They have costumes and candy and party goods, a really seamless, easy shopping experience. And now they also offer free delivery and curbside pickup if you're not wanting to shop in store. So definitely recommend checking them out. I got a ton of amazing Halloween goodies and I got everything I'm about to show you in this haul video for under $100. So I decorated our entire entryway for Halloween on a budget and I'm really excited about it. So the first couple of items I got are these adorable little silver crows. And I knew I kind of wanted to do like a spooky witch room parking kind of look in our entryway. And I thought that these little crows would be the perfect touch. And these are the silver crows. I'm gonna go ahead and link everything down in the description box. I know that some of the items are available online and some are in store only, um, but I'll still link everything so that you can easily find it. But you can see that this little crow just has so much detail. He's literally furry and soft. He has a beautiful kind of like metallic silver paint on him. He's just perfect. Love his little feet. So I got two of these little guys to go at the top of the display in our entryway. So the next Halloween goodie that I picked up is this gauze kit. And this is really neat because it comes with not only this really spooky, creepy gray gauze, but also a bunch of these good sized glittery bats that you can either stick throughout the gauze or you could even put them in flight like above the mantle, for example. I did that last year. Um, and they do come with adhesive on the back of the bat, so they're very easy to stick on. Um, I already took the gauze out because it's in my display, but I'll be showing you guys that at the end of this video. But this entire gauze kit was only $5.99, and this is like a really good sized amount of gauze, and I think you get eight bats, so an amazing deal. I also picked up these really cool bat cutouts. It does come with 30 bats, so you're gonna get a ton um, in four different sizes. They have the large ones, the medium ones, the small ones, and then really extra small ones. So you can create kind of like the bats in flight idea that I was telling you guys about, which I did over our mantle last year. And I also added some in my display this year. Then I got this little guy as a cute little addition and he was just $1.99 and he is just the cutest little tinsel spider. He's got the little googly eyes and the little plastic legs and he's actually fairly sturdy. My two year old's been running around with this little guy. He thinks he's the itsy bitsy spider and he loves him um, and he's been thrown around and everything and he's hanging in there. You could even add these on your mantle crawling up or crawling up your front door. So just a ton of really great ideas with this guy under two bucks. Then I just went ahead and picked up two glow sticks because these were on clearance for only 99 cents and my boys love to wear these light stick necklaces when we go trick-or-treating. Um, not only are they fun, but they also help other people in cars to be able to see you when you're out. So picked up two of these light stick necklaces. Then I got probably my favorite purchase of the day. <laughs> I have always wanted to have a skeleton and I saw that Party City had this really good size skeleton for only, get this y'all, $12.99. I have literally seen so many skeletons that were this size that were a ton more and that's why I've never picked one up. But this guy was so affordable, he looks super real. So he's 35 inches long, which I think is great size. He looks great on a bench, in a rocking chair. Um, I'm saying we fell in love with this guy. My sister and I strapped him into her SUV. He was nice and buckled in and everything. So I brought him home and my boys fell in love with this guy. They named him Mr. Bones and he just kind of hops around our house during the Halloween season so far. So it's almost like Elf on the Shelf, but it's like corpse on the porch. I don't, nothing really rhymes with corpse. He's been making an appearance all over the place. He's just a really fun little decoration. He also has this little string on his head so that you could hang him up outside. But he's found a cozy little spot on our bench by the front door. So I love Mr. Bones. He's super fun. Of course, because I'm doing a witch theme in the entryway, I had to pick up a bunch of their witch hats. 
And these are really good size, really nice quality for only $3.99 a piece. So I picked up four of these and these are great to wear. I mean, you could definitely wear them. Look, the top stays up, which I love. Um, so you could wear these or you could do the um, witch hat luminary idea that I've seen on Pinterest where you hang them by the point and then you could even hang a glow stick in here and have them along your front porch. Just a ton of fun ideas with these witch hats and you can't beat them at under $4 a piece. Of course, no Halloween witch scene would be complete without a cauldron. So I was really excited to find this huge black kettle. Um, this is about 15 inches, so a really good size. It does have a handle and little pedestal feet, which is so cute. And yes, I actually kept <laughs> the shipping material that came inside of it in there because I thought kind of like from a distance, it looked like smoke. So just a cheap filler for the cauldron to make it look like there's something kind of like bubbling in there. Um, but this was an amazing deal as well, only $9.99. And this is, like I said, a really good size. So this is perfect for display. It would also be great and good size for a ton of trick-or-treat candy. And as you guys know, any good witch needs her broomstick. So I picked up a few of these really neat broomsticks at Party City. This is the super realistic one. It reminds me so much of the Wizard of Oz when the Wicked Witch holds her broomstick up and catches it on fire. Do you guys know the scene I'm talking about? I feel like this broom looks identical to the broom in that movie. So it's just very realistic, really cool. You can see it's got the knotted rope here and then a really long bamboo handle. Um, so I got one of these and then I picked up two of these really cool crooked brooms. These are so fun for a display. I loved them. Look at the crooked stick. And it's actually like it has a rough texture so it feels super realistic. And then the end is this really cool long bunch of sticks. And I got mine in black, but I saw that they also had, I think, green and purple. So that was everything that I picked up at Party City for my Halloween decor this year. And now I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how everything turned out styled in our entryway. And be sure to check out Party City. I'm telling you guys, you're going to love it. They have something for everyone. You have to go check it out. So I'm going to go ahead and link everything down below and stay tuned for my entryway reveal. So here is the final look in our entryway and you can see that I used all of my Halloween goodies from Party City to decorate this space and I absolutely love how it turned out. So let me get a little bit closer so that I can share with you guys all of the details in our entryway. So here along the mantle of our board and batten entryway you can see that I added this really creepy gauze kit and it looks so spooky and fun. And you can see that I just attached the little black glitter bats that came with the gauze kit. And I added my two little silver crows at the top to balance it out. And then above that, I just added some of those cute bat cutouts. Then on the hooks, I hung these witches hats as well as the brooms that I picked up. And I think it's such a cute look. It looks like they just came in and set all of their stuff down. Um, then we have our cauldron here, of course, with the shipping material in there that I thought kind of looked like bubbling water. Then I have an old stack of books and our little spider. And then, of course, we have Mr. Bones there chilling on the bench with the witch's hat. So I absolutely love how this look turned out. I think it's really spooky and fun. And for under $100, you can't beat it. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Be sure to go check me out over on Instagram at Bentley Blonde to get a ton more fall and Halloween inspiration. And check out Party City and all of the product links in the description box below. And until next time, guys, bye-bye.